Hey guys, how you doing? Welcome back. So now we're gonna do uh, how to set up email on mobile devices for um, your iPhone. You need to know this because you may be helping a customer and they're probably troubleshooting email and stuff like that. So let's do that real quick. Um, so I have a screen, the screen sharing app to show you how it works. So let me share my screen real quick. All right, cool. So. This is my mobile device. I have it. I do have an iPhone now. I have an iPhone and an Android device. Um, so what you want to do is, if you ever have issues with your email, um, so I'm gonna do is I'm gonna I'm gonna go to the store. So I'm gonna type App Store. So it's right there, right? What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna type Outlook in here, and I'm gonna download Outlook. And it should download it by default for me is I am not going to put a crazy because I have to put my password over and over again. I'm going to get I'm going to get really upset about that one. So. <laughs> so we have that open right now. It's trying to open. All right. Let's get it in there. Um, add an account. So we're going to we're going to skip that. We're going to go to Kevin at. Kev Tech IT support dot com is gonna ask me to approve it for my Android device because it's tailored to my Android device which I have it open right now in my hand. Um, and I had done, put 12 in there, put done. Uh, maybe later. And that's it. Uh, yeah, turn on. Uh, allow notifications. So it looks like it looks almost similar to the other one, his settings. You have your signature right here. You have your mail. You have your accounts. Mail is right here. I'm going to turn that off. I don't like that. Um, and you could you could reset the account too if you don't like if you don't like what you know like you don't like what it's doing. Uh, signatures are right here. Mail is right here. This this is the account. You could reset the account. You could remove the account. Like common troubleshooting steps for for I guess for uh the Outlook app would be um uninstall reinstalling the app. You could reset it, which is what I just show you how to do. Um, you could also add it on your mobile device. So like I could go here and similar to what I did with the other one, hit mail. It says select uh other select Microsoft Exchange. So Mel wants to use Microsoft without in to sign and continue. So then here you will put your email address and it should, it should work now. So this is the, I looked up, I found the article on how to do it. Uh, I put the wrong password by accident. Give me a second. And again, it's gonna prompt my my Android device because my Android device is the print is the is the main one, right? Let me show that me in. Uh, it's fine. It's fine. And save. And that's it. And uh, it should it should update. So you got to give it a second. Let's give it a second. It may 
hopefully it's not quarantined. So sometimes what happens is it gets quarantined, which is why the emails are not coming up. So we'll see. I open up my Outlook email here to see if I get any emails about it being quarantined. But just for checking email services and stuff like that, let me go here. Let's go to... Yeah, just stay in office.com. Let's go to Exchange Admin Center. Let's go to Exchange. Like nothing's coming up yet. Uh, let's go to Kevin. Let's go to Manage Mobile Devices. The iPhone is there. Oh, there we go. I found it. There we go. Now it's there. I'm like, why is it not showing up? It finally showed up. It's finally. So for troubleshooting email on, on iPhones, it's the same thing. You literally, sometimes to fix the problem, like I'll go to my email to show you. Um, if their email's not working, it could be because they have VPN installed on their, on their device. So you may want to go into VPN and just make sure that there's no VPN connected to it. Um, here also, you could manage device management here as well. Um, just make sure VPN is not connected. Um, and then troubleshooting for mail as well. I have two accounts. This is my Gmail account and this makes sense. Sometimes the contacts don't work. You can uncheck it, recheck it. Uncheck calendar, delete from iPhone, put it back. Uh, mail day succinct means how many, how many, how much emails you get. Is it so I get emails up to one month, up to two weeks, up to three weeks, up to three days. I could change that here. I do automatic replies here as well. Um yeah, and that's how you that's how you troubleshoot this. And then you can just delete it when you're done. But that's it. That's how you that's how you troubleshoot emails and mobile devices. So with that being said, um, I am going to get out of this. Stop sharing. I'm going to stop sharing here too. And that, that's pretty much um, Apple devices in a nutshell. Um, hopefully this helps you out and have a good day. Later.